Second update. Am I the asshole for making my wife pay daycare late fees out of her allowance? It's been a few weeks since my last update and things have gotten even more complicated. After the whole daycare situation and the civil court ruling, my wife came up with the idea that we should hire a nanny. She said it would be a good solution so that we wouldn't have to worry about being late for daycare pickups anymore and we could have someone more flexible with our schedules. We started interviewing candidates and things were looking promising until we got to one particular nanny who seemed perfect. She was experienced, great with kids and professional, but during the interview, she mentioned something that raised an eyebrow. She said she had kids of her own and would need to leave by a specific time each day to take care of them. If she had to stay later, she wanted it written into the contract that she would be paid triple her regular rate for any time over. I don't know if she somehow knew about my wife's chronic lateness, but it sure felt like it. My wife was not happy with this condition and flat out refused to add it to the contract. The nanny, being firm about her time, politely declined to work for us if we couldn't agree to her terms, and that was that. Another chance at reliable childcare gone and we're back to square one. I've let my wife handle the search for a new nanny or daycare, but she's only speaking to me in monosyllables these days, clearly still holding a grudge. In the meantime, her lateness is starting to spill over into her professional life. Last week, she had a virtual meeting with a client to discuss a potentially big contract. We were really counting on that deal. It would have set us up for the next six months, maybe longer. But she was 10 minutes late to the meeting and when she finally joined, our son was crying in the background. It didn't make a great impression and she didn't land the contract. We have a family budget where we both contribute equally with allowances for each of us after taking out a portion for savings. With that contract falling through, she's not going to be able to contribute her 50% soon. And honestly, all I feel is sadness about how this is turning out. Her chronic lateness, something I used to find quirky and even cute, has now become a real liability both for our family and for her career. It's reached the point where I'm questioning whether I want to stay in this marriage if this is how life is going to be. I love my wife, but her refusal to respect time is causing real damage, and I'm not sure how long I can continue watching everything unravel without her taking accountability.